Penelope Gwen, and today I'm bringing you a Poison Ivy inspired makeup tutorial. After priming my eyes with Urban Decay's eyeshadow primer potion, I'm going to brush the dark green from the Kat Von D Sage Shade and Light Eye Palette along my crease, focusing the darkest area just below the inner brow. Create a point from the waterline outwards to use as a guide for the shadow, then define further. Bring this colour onto the lower lash line. Now pat Sugar Pills Midori onto the lid and blend it into that dark green. Then take Acid Berry and pat this colour onto the inner corner and blend onto the outskirts of the eyeshadow. With various shades of green, contour along the bridge of the nose. Keep this area subtle and well blended. Sugar pills absinthe into the inner corner and blend out. To add definition to the eye, I'm using Sugar Pills Bulletproof, focusing on the outer V. Now pack the white highlight colour from the NYX Highlight and Contour Palette onto the brow bone, inner corner and highlight along the bridge of the nose. Now take an MUA black pencil and line the waterline. Fill in the brows using the deep red from the NYX Lip Cream Palette. Start by marking out the initial shape, then fill in. Blend the colours into the hair with a spoolie. Use Jeffree Star Cosmetics Weirdo Lipstick as liquid liner by applying it with a thin liner brush. Start by following the lash line, getting thicker and higher as it reaches the outer corner. Then bring it up and out into a thin point. Curl your lashes and apply Urban Decay's Perversion Mascara in wiggling motions from root to tip. Now take Sugar Pills Airash Lashes and apply eyelash glue to the band. Let this dry for at least 30 seconds, then gently arrange them onto your lash line. I like to pinch mine so they merge nicely with my natural lashes. Apply liner to any visible glue. I'm now going to add some dark green contour to the cheekbones and temples, blending it out with a flat buffing brush. Put 
pat and buff the sugar pearl greens onto the contoured areas until it's nice and smoky. Highlight the cupid's bow with absent eyeshadow. Then line and fill in the lips with sleek makeup red lip liner. Apply NYX Cosmetics Intense Butter Gloss in Cranberry Pie all over the lips. I'm now going to stick ivy leaves onto my temples using eyelash glue. You could use fake ivy leaves but I found these outside my house and thought they'd look a lot better. I recommend washing and sanitising them if you're going to use real leaves. I'm then going to contour my chest. This step is optional, but gives more of a comic book character feel. I'm using the Cream Contour and Highlight Palette by Meron, using the brown shades to define the cleavage and collarbones. Buff out these lines using a fluffy brush. Then go in with the palest shade and highlight the high points of the chest, collarbones and boots. Blend this out with a Real Technique sponge and set with powder. Define the inner cleavage with the brown powder from the NYX contour palette and go over the highlighted areas with the white highlight colour. And there we have it, contoured boobs. I'm now patting Midori onto prime shoulders adding acid bay around the edges. Then cover the entire shoulder area with absinthe for a green highlight. And we're done! Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I loved creating it.